What's up guys? Shamil here, new auto glass, and I have a chip here, it's size of a quarter, but it's not a regular chip, this is not a bullseye. So the way it happened was it got hit, but it created a ring. The middle part is solid, but the chip is a ring. I have never seen a chip like this, so I'm gonna try to fix it. I told the customer, it's I don't know how it's gonna come out, I've never seen it. But let's see how it comes out. I'm gonna be using the GT Tools Vanish and see what it has. So what I'm gonna have to do is probably drill hole over here so I could fill this half and then drill hole over here and uh, fill the other half and see how it comes out. So this is what it looked like, it's size of a quarter. All right, let's see what it, what can we do? All right, so I drilled a hole on, hold on, let me balance the camera. Let me adjust it, here we go. So I drilled a hole on this side and I just start pushing the uh, resin in and see what it does. I'm gonna try to, uh, I mean the ring already disappearing. It went all the way around here and already here. So it looks like it's filling the, and it's already bleeding out of this here. I don't know if you can see it. So resin is going in. It's just I've never seen a ring bullseyes you know cracks and you know little chips but a ring so this is an experimental see how it comes out gt gt tool vanish look it's bleeding i don't know if you can see it so yeah right there see it on this angle so it's it is bleeding it is filling the circle so that's good the pressure is working the hole that i drilled is connected with the uh, crack we'll see how it goes then I'm gonna have to take care of this part too I think this what it hit and then it created because it looks like there's a hit right here and here so I'm gonna fill this then I'm gonna get to this and see what it looks like this is what it looks like from outside all the resin uh, resin is bleeding out so it is filling the ring and I put 20 drops in there, having an extra. And it's set at the lowest one. I don't think I ever used the third or second level because it's too much pressure. The first level, the lowest one is enough. Sorry, the camera can't get the uh, focus for some reason, but you get the idea. Let me zoom out. I don't know why it does that. But yeah, it's bleeding. It's working, GT tools. I love this tool. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, GT Tool sent this to me, and I freaking love it. Yep, it's bleeding out. Let's see. I'll give it a five more minutes and see what it looks like. I'll give back to you in a few seconds. All right, so the ring is filled. I drill a hole right here. I haven't cured it yet. Now the little chip on top, I just drilled it there. And I'm gonna fix this little chip, a little crack, see if I could get to it. Uh, like I said, this is the first one for me, a ring instead of being a chip with another little chip right on top of it. So it's basically two little, one little chip and then a ring. I mean, so far, vanish, fix this one. So there's gonna be a circle in the middle because it was a ring. There's nothing I can do about that, but we'll see what happens with this one here. Sorry, I'm just trying to keep the cam camera steady. All right, just give it another five minutes. See how this comes out, and then I'll show you um, what it looks like when it's done. All right, curing process. GT Tools comes with a built-in battery, and you're supposed to charge it. I never charge it because I have this Milwaukee battery with this attachment. So all my tools are Milwaukee. I just plug in my uh, USB-C to it. It takes the USB-C and I just push the button. And I always have a, have a power because this way if I forget to charge it, I always have a power. So it's curing. And curing uh, vanish is 15 seconds, but I always give it an extra. Extra, I don't think in my opinion will hurt just to be safe yeah so it's curing right now weird chip ring with the chip 
and hold on, see, 15 seconds stop. Let's do one more. There you go, it's curing. All right, I'll clean it up and I'll show you the end result. All right, and that is a finished product, finished result. The ring, the crack is in a circle. The inside of a circle is the solid area, which didn't have to be filled. I drilled right here. Uh, yeah, I drilled right here and drill over there because a little chip here and this filled the whole circle all right let me just fill the pits and cure it one more time and that's it this is gt tools vanish yeah right there just sitting there with the lights uv lights three suction cup bridge i mean i love this tool definitely recommend it if you want to upgrade your uh, chip repair game thank you guys this was like the first one for me experimental see how it comes out you guys tell me what you guys think was it a good enough not bad okay bad be honest let me know it's a it wasn't a regular bullseye it was a ring thank you guys and have a good day